Hello everyone, this is Kelly with Honey Bee Stamps and I'd like to welcome you to the Honey Bee YouTube channel. Today I am bringing you the final video with the Autumn Splendor release. All these products will be available on August 23rd at honeybeestamps.com. First I'd like to share the coordinating stencils that go right along with our patchwork pumpkin stamps and coordinating dies as you can see here on the screen. So it is a two-piece stencil set. You can see the three layering pieces for that stencil. So you can brush on three different colors, layer those together to make a 3D pumpkin. You can also use the stencil pack to color in the rest of the images from that stamp set. So you can color in the florals and you can see all those etched lines so it makes it super easy to line up, color in those stamped images. There's also the stems and the leaves. Next are the coordinating stencils for the trick or treat stamp set. This is so cute to create the perfect little trick or treat scene. So as you can see there are mirror images of the trees, there's the fence, there's little jack-o-lanterns, bats, ghosts, and the little gravestones there. This is a two-piece stencil set, as I mentioned, so the second stencil is going to give you three different options for a haunted house. Also, wispy clouds and two different layering moons. There's a crescent moon and also a full moon, and if you notice there, you can brush on a bright color for the full moon and then a darker color for the craters on the moon. Next is the Art Deco stencils. There are three stencils in this pack. Now these specifically coordinate with our Art Deco stacking dies. So there's a small Art Deco piece in this stencil. Here's a look at those dies that coordinate perfectly with this stencil set. So you can cut those out, layer them on top of your stenciled paper. So again, that's the small one. Here is a larger size. You can see there the size comparison, and again, there are dies that will coordinate with both of those sizes. And then the third stencil in this collection is just those diamonds or crossed hatch design. So this is a great staple to have in your stencil collection. You could use that on any card style. And here's one more look at all three of those stencils together. Next are the Scattered Leaves stencil set. Now this is a layering two-piece set. So to my right is the base layer that's gonna give you all the color for your leaves. And then the stencil to the left is gonna give you all the details for those leaves. So you can see all the little stems and veins running through those leaves. They do match up and line up and layer perfectly, so super easy to line those up over your base layer to create a great scattered leaf design. I also think that that base layer that I'm showing here would be great as waves on a beachy or summertime card. So really cool design here that you will get lots of use out of for many different types of cards. Next is our warm and cozy cable knit sweater stencil. You can see what great texture this will bring to all of your fall and winter cards. You see the braided yarn, what looks like a warm and cozy winter sweater. Now next up are our paper pads, and this one is the Gingham Galore Fall Edition. You can see all the great colors there. I'm going to open up this brand new paper pad so we can take a close-up look. Now the front side of each uh, sheet of paper in this paper pad has whatever color and then a white check and it runs straight. Now the back side has the same color and a muted color in that color family and it runs on the diagonal. So you've got a couple of different options here for each color family. There is an eggplant, kind of a burgundy color, and then we move into oranges and corals. And then we move into kind of a lighter orange and then yellow. I love that harvest gold yellow color. And then we move into lots of blues. So there's lighter blues, almost teal. There's dusty blues. And then you can see this here on the right, more of a kind of true blue. I'm going to keep flipping through these beautiful colors here. There are browns. You can see the dark chocolate brown there. 
if I flip it over those yummy brown colors on the back. And then we're back to the beginning and do a quick little flip through so you get a look at all those beautiful colors again. Now there are two sheets of each color in this paper pad. So there are 24 sheets all together. Here are the coordinating envelopes that match perfectly to that gingham galore fall paper pad. I'm going to take these beautiful envelopes out of their package so we can get a close up look. So we have that beautiful eggplant color to begin with. If I flip it over and open it up, you're going to see the same color, but with polka dots on the inside. So here's kind of a more burgundy color and the beautiful, cute polka dots on the inside. And then we go into our orange. And then we move into coral. Those cute little white polka dots on the inside. And then we move into a more true orange. I love all the color options here for fall. There's that yummy yellow that I love. Now we're going to move into our blues. And here's kind of a light minty teal blue. And then a more dusty blue. And then there is a lighter, more true blue color. And then there's a little bit darker of a blue. And then we're going to move into the browns. So there is a light brown, kind of a taupey color, it's beautiful, and the darker brown. Now all of these have self-adhesive on the inside. All you have to do is peel up the little strip and then seal your envelope. So here is a look at the Gingham Galore Fall Paper Pad and its coordinating envelopes. Now our next new paper pad is the Halloween Harvest Paper Pad. This is so cute and it's such a great mix of fun Halloween designs plus more fall harvest designs. So we have some leaves and we have leaves on the back. You can see the great eggplant color there. There's a beautiful bright floral. If I flip it over, there's kind of a watercolor inky background with yellows and eggplant and burgundy. There's orange stripes and those cute little jack-o'-lanterns. If I flip this one, you get a great kind of floral design. There's plaids and polka dots. There's a great plaid there on the right. And there's another leafy or floral design and then a green leaf. If I flip it over, you have some scattered leaves there on a green background, green stripes, green polka dots, and then little skeletons or little skulls on purple paper, a purple plaid, and then a purple stripe, purple polka dots, a cute black and white spider's web. You have black and white leaves. I love all those little fall leaves and you can't go wrong with black and white. There's a little cluster of ghosts, so cute, and a hound's tooth. And then we are back at the beginning and I'll do a flip through here so you can see all the gorgeous colors and patterns in the Halloween Harvest paper pad. And then we're back to the beginning again with all those yummy eggplant colors. Now there is a gem set that goes with this and these are 300 count gem stickers. So these have the adhesives on the back. All you have to do is pick up your little gem and place it anywhere you'd like to go on your card. And you can see all of those colors match that beautiful Halloween Harvest paper pad perfectly. Now there's also an envelope collection that goes along with the Halloween Harvest paper pad and there are 12 envelopes in this set. They are A2 size, so they're going to fit all of your four and a quarter by five and a half inch cards. And let's take a close up look at these. So we have that beautiful eggplant and if I open it up on the inside, you'll see the beautiful fall leaves. There is the inky background with the floral on the inside. Next is a leafy envelope. They're very subtle in the background. It looks like ink blended leaves. They're so beautiful with a stripe on the inside. Next are those cute little pumpkins and if we open this up 
there is that orange floral pattern. Next are the orange with black and white polka dots and that fall or Halloween plaid on the inside. There is the leafy or floral with the plaid on the inside. Next is the green leaf. I love these little scattered leaves. There's a green with a black and white polka dot and a stripe on the inside. There's the purple skulls with the hound's tooth on the inside. I love that pairing together, the purple with the black and white. There's purple polka dots with those cute little ghosts peeking out from the inside. And there are the black and white fall leaves with a purple plaid on the inside. Now again, all of these are self-adhesive. As you can see here with the spider web and the purple on the inside, all you have to do is pull off that little strip and then adhere the flap for your envelope. And this is the Halloween Harvest Paper Envelope and Gem Collection. Now that is it for the whole Autumn Splendor release. I hope you'll check out all of our products at honeybeestamps.com coming August 23rd, and I will talk to you guys next time. Thank you for joining us this week. Bye-bye.